let's start to show off with Apple. Start to show off with Apple. And I want to do this a little different because um, I know Apple has been a stock that um, we've talked about for since the inception of the show, um, yep. four years now. And um, I know you've always said, you know, you got to have Apple as one of the primary investments, Apple and Microsoft and two, two index funds. Um, but there's been some concern. So they gave up on their, on their electric car, which they've been pushing for a long time. And they, they kind of scrapped the plans on that. Mm-hmm. Um, they also smart. got hit with a $2 billion fine mm-hmm. from Europe over, over music streaming apps. Um, also vision pro, which we actually did a whole thing on, uh, sales are slow. Allegedly. <laughs> Shotty, we're gonna keep it real. The sales are slower than they should be. First okay. week is great. Second week, not so much. Well, we gotta see. Well, we, in all fairness, we gotta see when the quarter is done. In all fairness, it's, 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 it just dropped. Okay, so okay. we gotta see. So, um, and you know, tech has been tremendous, um, but Apple not so much. No. Apple for the last six months is down. Year to date is down. Mm-hmm. One one year it's up, but you know when when Nvidia and all the even Microsoft has been on a rise for six months has been down. Year to date's down. Three months is down. One month down. One week down. SMCI one year is cooking. Yeah. One year down. Mm-hmm. Microsoft moving. It's the, this this is the inevitable question. All things come to an end. All things cool off. Um, is this the beginning of the end? Is this the fall of Apple? Yeah. No, it's not the end of Apple. It's um they're just moving in the natural progression of what the stock market is doing overall, with the exception of NVIDIA, SNCI, and a few others. Um, should the Vision Pro be better? Yes. Uh, could the sales be better? Yes. iPhone needs innovation. I think Tim Cook probably needs a second in command that can help out a lot as well. Um the yellow shirt great. is in the building. Yes. Shout to my guy for fixing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Appreciate you, bro. So yeah. Um, I think they need Johnny Ive back, but if we look, I'm happy that they killed that car project. Sometimes when we get into wars and people say things that we don't like, we take on business ventures that we shouldn't to kill somebody who's pissing us off. If we look at um, Tesla, their operating margin is 9%. Gross margin is 18%. Why build a car when if you sell it, you're only going to get 18% for uh, $18 out of every hundred that are sold. I'm glad they killed that. They need a lot more innovation. I know NVIDIA is going up, but just because NVIDIA and SMCI got a BBL, it does not mean that Michelle Obama is not a great wife. Great. They're having their run. But if I've made you money off Apple and Microsoft, please put yes in chat. And if Apple was going to fall apart, I would be the first one to say, yo, Tim Cook cooked. Done for. I can't wait for the demise of Apple so I can come on here and say, yo, it's over. It's over. But <laughs> you would be it would be unwise for you to sell off this company at this time when they haven't put forth their AI project. I think eventually that you're vision pro price. Will yeah, come you're being down kind. Price. You're being kind. It wouldn't be wise of you. No, it'd be foolish of you. It'd be dumb as hell. Okay. There we go. There you go. So I mean, um, we, we spoke about this, right? Like we spoke about this right before their earnings. We said, look, this is four quarters in a row where we haven't seen innovation, where we've seen the iPhone sales go down. We talked about the importance of the iPhone and how 50% of the revenue comes from that product alone. Um, and we weren't surprised that it pulled back. Um, and so this is one of those things when when stocks trade sideways, right? And we've seen this happen in 2018 with Apple. And it's like, well, what's happening? What's happening with Apple? And then it has a run and it goes on a split. And so it's consolidating a little bit. The rest of the market is moving, but it's still the, what, the number two most valuable company in the world. And the EV move was smart. I agree with you. I think it was a smart move yeah. rather than spending so 10, 10 more years. Chasing in the beginning. Yeah. yeah. It's, it, it's been a 10 year project that hasn't come to fruition and it probably it, it wasn't going to come to fruition. It's unfortunate that 2000 jobs were lost and a lot of the, the people who were working on those projects, their jobs are lost, but the new focus is Rivian. AI. It, no, well, the new focus is AI. And from what Tim Cook is, is, is leading or kind of hinting toward it, this is going to be the mother of all AI projects. That, that's that's the forecast for what they're gonna announce in June. 
And so, yeah, well, they keep promising well, things and they and they not delivering. Hey, sh Shotty, let's well, talk. Well, they, let's well, let's well, take the well, kick off. Well, <laughs> well, the well here's why. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Tim Cook, we're gonna, okay. we're gonna turn so, this into blackout when, when, in a minute. The when, girl, the real. girl, keep promising, but she keep doing the same thing. You, but <laughs> it's time to go. Yeah, let her go. No, it's time. time to go, baby. Now, what, see, this is what I'm saying. Saying it's time to go wouldn't be the wise thing. I'm not saying it's time to go off right. of Apple, but right, I'm just saying. What I'm saying is, you keep promising things. You promised the best electric car, flop. You, you promised, promised the best crypto, promised. a crypto wallet, didn't do it. Flop. The, the the bank merger with um that didn't work with Goldman, Goldman Sachs. Sachs did not work. Flop. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. keep going. The um the the glasses, iPhones, fifteen, iPhones, sixteen, piece flop. of shit. Oh, what you is the, a lot is of the iPhone the it's number one bricks. selling smartphone? At one point, Marbury was the number one. What? Guy. <laughs> but, 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 but I'm saying, well, we got wait, what's the number one wearable in the world right now? I'll wait. Um, for women, the rose. No, 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 no. <laughs> Try again. Try again. What's the number one wearable? I got a man, AirPod, right? Okay. And what's the number one wearable watch? Apple so watch. They are delivering. Like, we can't ignore what they are. They are delivering. What I'm saying is, like, when I see consolidation like this, and we'll talk about this a little bit more on Wednesday, but this is a time for me. Like, okay. Let this yeah. fall a little bit more. I mean, if ideally, we, I want it at one forty-seven. If we're gonna have a whole move, different conversation come June. One sixty-four, I'll be happy. But yeah, like I see by summer, it should get to like we we gonna have a whole different conversation when the summer comes. Let this yeah. fall a little bit more, and we are gonna have some plays. And and, and, and it's gonna morning. be time to load the boat. But Rashad makes <laughs> a great point. L listen, they have not delivered. If I can put on my SWOT analysis hat, if I look at weaknesses, iPhone sales are yes. slowing. Ch China's an issue. There's very little innovation that people feel. Now, have they innovated in iOS? Yes. But it doesn't feel like a robust investment into the software. Even the in hardware, this, marginally better. Even in this market, how far have they fallen back? Have, have, have they even had a, what could be considered a correction? They went from 192 or 184 to speak currently at 175. So, no. But And, and wherever You're Apple right. goes, the rest of the market will go. But uh, and that's not true anymore. That's of the... But that's not even true anymore, right? Because it, we used to see that, right? If Apple didn't report well, if the sales were down, if Apple fell in the day, we saw the market move. Now Apple's been doing it for about two or three weeks. And that's the market, only because Nvidia has been pulling and exactly. Bitcoin is dragging it up. But what people aren't seeing, there's like, like if Apple is slowly pulling down and there's 493 other, other companies that are not doing amazing, like even if we look at a sector, the military and defense sector is not doing well. How and y'all waged that war for two years straight over there. This shit makes no sense at all. I think the rest of the economy will be drugged down, and we have to be very honest. Remember when two years ago when I said uh the banks are gonna come on, come in and take over Bitcoin and Ethereum and everybody laughed me at the building. Now BlackRock owns 17.8 billion dollars worth of Bitcoin. The banks need crypto to stay afloat to hide the losses that they have. Hot the inner Ponzi scheme, honest take. <laughs> honest take so without crypto the banking market shout out to crypto 901 shout out to keys everybody going crazy on crypto without bitcoin the banks would be shit right now that's the saving grace and one i mean nike absorbed and one and took all the benefits of that and turned it into white chocolate if it was not for crypto the banks would be in shambles i agree with rashad I apple hasn't delivered probably in three or four years on what they said they were going to do I still love Apple. I'm still holding it long term. It's one of my biggest hope, my biggest holding in my portfolio and my sons. Clip that up. But <laughs> Yo, what, what, what was that? You just did a shake right there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm keeping it clean. <laughs> but next week I'm going to go crazy. Loco, muy loco. But um, they need to innovate better. And I'm always worried about like in this conversation that we have, right? Like, what can we do to be better or be different? They didn't see blackout coming. I love it. Great. Me and Shadi vibing well, looking good in the fur. The, the, you had the pony hair combo. <laughs> Joe. Shout out to Joe. Should have been there. Shout out to Joe, you? right? Where, Where, were you? Joe. Where were you? With Candace Owens. <laughs> Candace Owens. <laughs> Great interview. Um, but but I think this company needs, needs to innovate or they need to acquire. I said two years ago, I think they should have acquired AMD if they would have how much higher what the stock would have been. Yeah. It's the innovator's dilemma. You have to always continuously get better no matter what. So would it be it's, fine? It's, yes, but but I think they've underperformed so far this year. Yes, that's fair. They have underperformed. We're not going anywhere. 
I think we can agree yep. on that. We're, we're not going anywhere.